Canada also says it's a big human rights defender. But internationally, it says it's going to save everyone, but it can't even provide drinking water to Indigenous communities here. And it's responsible for this on its own territory. It doesn't even see the end to this. Canada also created peacekeepers. They think they're peacekeepers worldwide, but at the same time, it seals peace deals with Middle Eastern country to buy armored vehicles and helps to arm totalitarian regimes who crush their people. Canada thinks it's green. We're for the environment. We want everyone to be good. We're going to plant two billion trees. It's great. But on the other hand, it's a petrol state that fi finances oil companies with yesterday's energy by ignoring tomorrow's energy. Canada says it's strong and united, that the idea of Canada is wonderful, but the Canadian identity, Mr. Speaker, is fragile. It is fragile. Albertans are more proud to be Albertan, and Quebecers are more proud to say they're Quebecers. Canada says it's a democratic country, but it stole the referendum in 1995. And Canada's history has been based on the assimilation of First Peoples. John A. Macdonald, the founder of Canada, was a racist. Even, people, even though people say he was a good guy. To construct identity, Quebec, Canada stole from Quebec. The maple leaf, there's almost no maple leaves in your country. And the beaver, you have no beavers. Mr. Speaker, if west of the Ottawa River, you can't even eat a poutine that's edible. And the only c cultural thing you have left is hockey, and they never even win in Toronto. And I said that in English so you could understand, all of you.